All right, guys. Um, another video for you here. Uh, this is going to be a video on how to uh, install the Master Boy um, emulator for your PSP. Uh, your PSP needs to be on custom firmware uh, 5.00 M33 or higher in order to run this. Um, so um, basically, this is what it is. It's a Sega Master System and a Game Boy Color emulator all in one. So the file I'm going to have you download is right here, the Master Boy. It's a RAR file, so uh, if you don't have an extraction program, you're just going to right-click and select Extract Files. If you do, um, just extract your files to your desktop. Uh, but if you do have an extraction program, just double-click on this and open it up. Now inside here, you're going to see Master Boy, and if you open that up, you're going to see the kernel version and the PSP folder leave it right here for now what you're gonna do is take your PSP and connect it in the USB mode alright so after you connect your USB mode open up the PSP's memory stick and you should see your PSP folder if you go back to the extraction program you're gonna see the PSP folder so go to your PSP's memory stick and open up the PSP folder and go into the game folder you're going to do now is take the PSP folder in the extraction program and you're going to see the game folder again. Open that up and you're going to see a Master Boy folder. Inside the Master Boy folder, you're going to see the color pack, logo, music, RES, ROMs, Game Boy Color, ROMs, Sega Master System, skins, default any, the eboot.ppp, and palatites any, and plugins any. So we're going to go back and have the Master Boy folder like that. And, um,. What you're going to do is just take the Master Boy folder and drag and drop that into the PSP's game folder. Now, I've already done that, so I'm not going to do that. And now I'm just going to show you where the ROMs go. So, after that's done copying over, you're going to open up the Master Boy folder. Now, ROMs for Game Boy Color are going to obviously go in this folder right here. What you're going to do is just take your ROMs and drag and drop them in there. As you can see, the Game Boy Color.gbc files. Um, there are already in here and you can also have your games saved as well so um, that's where the ROMs go for Game Boy Color and for Sega Master System they go in this folder but I don't have any in there right now um, just because I didn't really like Sega that much so um, other than that that's about it so um, there you go Master Boy you have to have it in your PSP's game folder as you can see and we go back you can clearly see that and just double check that it's in there and when you're done just exit this out and get out of USB mode and uh, what you're gonna do is just scroll over to your game and go to your memory stick again you have to be on custom firmware in order for this to work um, just select it run the game it's gonna open up the emulator and circle is gonna be your confirmation button and X is gonna be the back button just to let you know because it's a a Japanese model emulator and they like to do things in reverse there so uh, other than that that's about it then just hit circle on the ROM that you want to play and it'll load it and you're good to go so that's about it so enjoy your emulator for Game Boy Advance and uh, Game Boy Color and Sega Master System and uh, you have any questions leave me a comment send me a message I'll be happy to reply more videos coming your way soon and I'll talk to you guys later